called Titan Clover. Clovers have a sand colored upper body, a wet underside, and orange legs. Unfortunately, due to habitat loss, nest disturbance, and predation, these birds are endangered. In 1983, there were only 12 clovers left. Clovers live in wide, flat, sandy beaches with very little vegetation or grass. Their nesting territories consist of small creeks and wetlands. Clover size can be just like During reproduction, the female lays four eggs in a small, shallow nest lined with pebbles and broken shells. Both the father and the mother care for their eggs and chicks. Finally, when the chicks hatch, they're able to feed themselves and run freely within hours. In spring and summer, clovers breed in north of the United States and Canada, the Great Lakes, north of Great Plains, and along the Atlantic coast. In the fall, clovers migrate to the Gulf of Mexico. Clovers are endangered due to the following reasons. Habitat loss slash degradation due to commercial, residential, and recreational developments. Nest disturbance due to changing water levels from dams and water control structures and predation from other animals. When humans preserve the nest, the parent birds are forced to the nest. Humans also crush eggs or young birds. Tell clovers, you can learn more about hiding clovers, how the destruction of habitat, about the loss of clovers, and other things. You can also join the conservation group at Coastal Habitat and volunteer nature centers.